how do I fuse the inside and outside and make it feel like it's one rather than there's a separation. This is your landscape and this is your house. It should feel like it's been worked on together rather than an afterthought. The material that ends up being used on the architecture of the home plays a big role in how we want to contrast those colors and maybe bring out some of the architectural detail in the window trims and the peak roofs and some of the geometry of the home and how we're going to play that off in the landscape and then if we're going to use natural stones or other materials for paving surfaces, how are they going to contrast and look with the architecture of the home? Very important. When you introduce a little bit of detail in your landscape, you can really make huge strides. And that being like certain pillows or textures on your outdoor furniture, certain pots or custom pots. Beauty is in the detail and it's subtle, right? So I would, I would tell homeowners, even if you're on a budget, a few of the specific little details that you put in your landscape and in the space that you inhabit, either on your deck or patio or through the yard, will make a great difference.